Hi, for this recording, I'm going to demonstrate to you how to show a mapping is a group homomorphism. Suppose you are given a mapping from M2 star, which is the set of 2 by 2 invertible matrices, where the operation is matrix multiplication now. Now you send the 2 by 2 matrix ABCD into 1101 times ABCD times the inverse of 1101. We are going to show that this mapping here is a group homomorphism. Now, to understand this, you must know what is the definition of group homomorphism based on John's text that a uh, first clause in abstract algebra, section 13, page 125, says that a mapping phi of a group G into a group G prime is a homomorphism if phi of A times B is equal to phi of A times phi of B. It holds for A all the A, B inside G. Now, you take note that the first multiplication, this is a multiplication in G. Binary operation in G. Whereas, the second operation is a binary operation in G prime. However, for our question, both G and G prime is just an M2 star. Now, let's see how to be sure that it is a homomorphism now. First, look at the image of A1, B1, C1, D1. Now, according to the definition, this is equal to 1101 times A1, B1, C1, D1 multiplied by the inverse of 1101. Now, image of A2, B2, C2, D2 in this case is equal to 1101 multiplied by a to B2, C to D2, and multiply by inverse of 1101. Now, how about image of the product? The image of the product in this case, according to definition, is actually 1101 multiply by the product A1, B1, C1, D1, multiply by A to B2, C to D2, multiply by inverse of 1101. Okay, now I'm going to do some magic here. What I'm going to do is, in this four product here, I am going to insert an extra term here. This is going to multiply by 1101 inverse and multiply by 1101 also. Right, so I insert the extra terms. A2, B2, C2, D2, as keep it, and then 1, 1, 0, 1, inverse. Notice that when I can do this because the term in the middle multiply is identity. Right, we can know this, we will know that this is identity. 1, 1, 0, 1, inverse, time 1, 1, 0, 1 is identity, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. And we know that identity has no effect in multiplication. And the first three term is actually image of A1, B1, C1, D1 under phi. So this, the first term multiplied together is image of A1, B1, C1, D1. And the next three terms combined together is actually the image of A2, B2, C2, D2. So we have shown that the image of the product is the product of the image. Therefore, we have shown that this is a homomorphism. The mapping phi here is a homomorphism. And that concludes the recording.